and welcome back to our private little beach it is time to revisit the summer collection summer by the sea by light elegance and this time we are going to create the cutest summer set you've ever seen well i think at least so we're going to start off with five tips we're going to do a different design on each tip starting off with female and fabulous which is uh white you can use any white really and then we go straight in with salty sweet, which is this, well, salty, shimmery, sparkly glitter. Love it. Coming in with French tip and creating these little lines to create kind of a, a seashell. So I'm just gonna actually mention something before we move on. If you see those little flashes that I put here in between the frames, you can see there, that means cure okay so throughout the video whenever you see those flashes that means cure okay moving on to ocean avenue beautiful color you don't actually have to cure in between this because we're gonna mush it together with sandcastle and oh my god this is my favorite one once upon a tide this is oh, a chunky beautiful gorgeous dream i love it so much and then i just faded over um the sandcastle curing and then coming in with sandcastle once again do not cure because we're gonna put some acrylic powder on top of this and then we're gonna cure you might want to double cure that actually and make sure that you really saturate that gel it can take a little while just scoop it all over and moving on to our little bubble thing here do you remember this it was super trendy a couple years ago so we're gonna use that for um well the bubbles in the water whatever that's called and then we're gonna add of course a little starfish and i'm building this up in two layers just to give it a little kind of 3d effect and then putting some little dots on it you can use any white you want um, I'm using this white just because it has a tiny little bit of shimmer, but you can use seriously any white you prefer. Okay, Sandy Bottoms, hello. This is such an amazing glitter. It sparkles like diamonds in the sky and or maybe like sparkly sand. And what I'm doing here, I'm just buffing this up and let's take a moment. Let's take a moment, soak this in. Oh, so nice just had to add a little nice extra close-up of that because it is very nice to look at uh, curing then just wiping that off and you have just a glittery sparkly nail of course we need to have that and for our next nail I wanted to create something like you know how Hawaiian type of flowers like when you have those swimsuit trunks that has the flowers on it I think you know what I mean this is such an easy and fun summer flower to do as you can see here I just put two colors into each other without caring and then pull it into the center and you have those yeah, I have no clue what the name is for this flower right now. Uh, you can comment down below if you want to. Um, but yeah, super easy, so much fun, makes everything look very like vacay, stylish. Um, just love it. Going in with some flat matte because I love to mix shiny and matte, of course. And I feel like this one really, really, really pops with that flat matte surface on. Moving on to Sand Castle, we're moving back to Sand Castle because we're gonna do another uh, nail with Sand Castle. I love this color, obviously. And then we're gonna saturate that with some more acrylic powder to get that nice textured look. And you might even want, you know, to take the powder and let it sit for a little while and then kind of brush it off and then double cure. Coming in with Don't Be Crabby because I want to create like starfish designs or like a 3D starfish. So what I do here is that I'm curing in between each layer and I think I ended up 
like creating like three layers yeah i did and then coming in with the coral cottage and adding those dots these are so cute you can of course do crab or whatever um sea creature you want on top of this and just adding a little bit more of those like um well seashells i'm gonna add a little another type of starfish and then building it up same way a couple of different layers curing in between and then adding as we did with the first nail those little stripes just to make it even more 3d and some more dots and when you are applying your super shiny on here because i wanted to have kind of the wet look like you know they just came out of the water um just make sure that you don't apply too much because then you will lose that 3d effect so really make sure to apply it thin brush it out a couple of times and then cure and here is your final result what do you think i love them i think they're so cute and um yeah i don't know what else to say it's just super summery cute hanging out by the ocean oh my god i want to have summer right now I am so ready for summer. Just bring it over here right now. And here you have the full collection for summer. Summer by the sea. And you can do so much fun designs with this. And guess what? It is out now. So if you have not grabbed yours yet, please go ahead and do that for sure. And as always, all products are HEMA-free, NINE-free, cruelty-free, gluten-free, and vegan. And we do believe that what's inside matters. And if you didn't know, we actually have a new Facebook group called Hashtag New to LE by Light Audience, where you can talk to other ambassadors, instructors, or just LE fans in general. Make sure to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell if you have not already. And thank you so much for watching. Bye!